Question number 8a. Describe how the xylem tissue is structurally adopted to its function. Uh, so this is the part that uh, uh, transport water from the ground to the reefs uh, and other functions. So we said they are structurally adapted. One of the point it can put across is Roman number one. They are connected end to end after reaching maturity. Uh, they are connected end to end after maturity. End to end after maturity. The protosum that is uh, the protoplasm dies and uh, the cell become Uh, becomes empty the end wall breaks and form tubes uh, that is uh, the end wall breaks uh, and form wrong tubes So this tube are able to to transport uh, the water. So Roman number two, another adaptation. Uh, so the Iraq war, hence they are continuous from root to leaf. Uh, Iraq uh, cross war, hence. They are con then they are continuous uh, from root to leaves. Number three. Uh, the walls are thick and reinforced with legging, legging to make them not collapse. So we say the walls are thick and uh, reinforced with uh, Ligging to make them not collapse. Not collapse. Uh, the other adaptation uh, which we can talk about here is uh, the cell wall are thick and dignified to make them have strength and remain always open so the cell wall I, I think that still would be covered in number uh, number 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 three so we go to another one uh, are made of dead cells are made of dead cells dead cells press end to end press so as not to absorb water so as not to absorb water uh, 
and the other adaptation is uh, uh, they are thin they are thin and wrong to allow for capillarity to allow for capillarity so those are some of the adaptations uh, to the functions of the xylem Question number 8b. Describe the functions of blood in human body. Uh, so blood is made up, uh, made up of uh, several components. For example, we have plasma, we have red blood cells, we have white blood cells, and we have uh, platelets. So we are go I'm going to describe each component, its function. So we start with plasma. So plasma is a liquid component, a mixture of water, sugar, fat. Uh, so it's a mixture of uh, mixture of uh, water, uh, sugar, that is sugar. Uh, we have uh, fat. We have a uh, protein, uh, we have uh, and salts. So this is the liquid part. Uh, so we say its functions, its function is to transport. To transport blood cells, blood cells uh, throughout the body, throughout the body, along with the nutrients. along with the nutrients, uh, waste products, waste product, we have antibodies, uh, we have uh, clotting, uh, we have, uh, that is a uh, clotting protein, uh, we have uh, uh, chemical messages such as hormones such as hormones and proteins such as protein that help maintain uh, that help maintain uh, maintain the body's fluid balance balance so that is a function of uh, uh, plasma uh, from there we go to red blood cells red uh, blood cells uh, which we also call RBC so uh, uh, they have a protein a protein known as hemoglobin which help carry oxygen which help carry oxygen 
uh, from the lungs to the rest of the body to the lungs to the rest of the body uh, at the same time it then uh, it, it carries uh, carbon dioxide to the lungs to be exhaled, exhaled. so it then uh, it then return uh, carbon dioxide CO2 uh, from the body to the lungs uh, so that is the work of the red blood cells the other component of blood is uh, the white blood cells white blood cells also known as leukocytes uh, so these cells uh, they protect the body from infection from infections that is they fight uh, the pathogens trying to get into the body for to infect the body uh, the last component is uh, platelets uh, also known as thrombocyte Uh, so these ones they help in blood clotting process uh, this the function of this they help in blood clotting process uh, so that is uh, uh, they gather around the injured part and they cover the, the, the open place uh, so that uh, no more loss of blood so that those are the that's how you describe the function of the blood in human body in terms of the blood components which includes uh, we have said the plasma the liquid part of the blood we have red blood cells the, their function is to transport oxygen from the body from the lungs to the rest of the body and bring back uh, carbon dioxide to be exhaled uh, then we have the white blood cells they are to protect the body from infections and uh, platelets they help in blood clotting so by doing that you should be able to get 15 marks and that brings us to the end of question number eight as well as the end of that paper two